here we go. Mankind, that word should have new meaning for all of us today. We can't be consumed by our petty differences anymore. We will be united in our common interests. Perhaps it's fate that today is the 4th of July, and you will once again be fighting for our freedom. Not from tyranny, oppression, or persecution. But from annihilation. No, sir, just a little anxious to get up there and whoop E.T.'s ass, that's all. We're fighting for our right to live. To exist. And should we win the day, the 4th of July will no longer be known as an American holiday. With cold. But as the day when the world declared in one voice, we will not go quietly into the night. We will not vanish without a fight. We're going to live on. We're going to survive. Today, we celebrate our Independence Day. <laughs> Mr. President. Wow. <laughs> His thoughts. I saw what they were planning to do. Their whole civilization. After they consume every natural resource, they move on. And where next? I've been waiting for this my whole life. Good God! Nuke them. Let's nuke the bastards. I'm sorry to say, far more advanced. Are you sure? This, I mean, there's no two ways about it. This is fantastic. As you can imagine, they, uh... They don't let us out much. Ever since I've been kidnapped by aliens 10 years ago, I've been dying for some payback. I can understand that. And I just want you to know that uh, I won't let you down. We're being stunned. Ship all banged up? Who's the man? Michael J. Fox 3! All right, you alien assholes. Up, go! That's what I call a close encounter. Well, uh, this is like to see the big tamale, huh? Yeah, <laughs> follow me.